Uh, what's going on guys? It's Lekton here, and this- this is a video that I never really wanted to make. Uh, it's a video that I really don't want to make right now anyways, but I just feel like I- I need- I need to talk about this, because I don't think anybody else is, so I- I might as well do it. The current state of bad business is- it's weird. I've been playing the game since when it first came out, so the game before was just much simpler and it was enjoyable. The movement in the game, which was unique, the updates would bring in new weapons that were unique. Uh, and I and I enjoyed the game very much. I mean, as you can tell, I've been doing bad business content for like half a year, probably even more. Uh, but I've taken a break recently, and I don't I don't think most of you know why, but the game it's just not the same anymore. They brought in this new movement, which I know many people don't like, and because many people don't like it because it's well changed, but I I don't like the movement because it takes away from the core identity of bad business. Sure, it's easier for new players to get into the game now because the movement isn't as hard, but I'm going to bring up an example here. So Phantom Forces, they do their movement very well. It's easy for new players to get into the movement. You know, they, they learn that they can, you know, WASD, they can sprint and stuff. Then they learn that they can slide, so they add that into their gameplay. And then they learn that they can super jump, so they add that, you know, you add vaulting, super jump, and all that. So, and you know, once you learn all of those things, you can start combining it, and that is how I think movement was done correctly. It was done very correctly in bringing in new players, but not making the game boring for players that have been playing the game for a long time and have mastered this movement a long time ago because it's very fun. And I think Bad Business, they had a good movement going, right? I I really enjoyed it and I know a lot of people enjoyed the spammy movement too. Uh, even though it wasn't really the best for new players, the players that had been there for a long time, they, they really enjoyed it. And I think there was something that Rudov could have done that would have made the movement easy for new players to get into, but yet still enjoyable for those players that have been playing the game for a long time. For example, by leaving just the normal sprinting, not the super sprinting, in the game, it could have brought so much more to the movement. You know, you combine the super sprinting with just the normal sprinting to come up with some sort of combos, I don't really know, but that could have added another layer to the movement of the game which I think a lot of which I think a lot of OG players and players that were really good at the movement before would have really appreciated because you know there's something new to learn with the movement right now it's just wait for the cooldown to disappear and then you can jump again or slide again or something like that I mean it doesn't it doesn't feel like bad business anymore then I also wanted to talk about the updates for the game and I know what a lot of you are going to say is that the devs are working hard on attachments and stuff but these passes are ruining the game. The fact that there have been four passes already is kind of crazy. I think by now there should have just been two. Like, the first two were fine. You know, you had the prototype pass and the World War II pass, which were both really good passes, not just because, you know, oh, this gun's really good in the pass, but, but because it added something new to the game. In my older videos, you'll hear me say that a lot over new bad business updates, saying that this new gun or whatever in the game, it it added something to the game. The Wild West Pass, I think that's when things started to dip a little bit, but it was still, it was still a good enough pass for me to enjoy it. With the Medieval Pass, it's, I'm sorry, it's just horrible. Who who wants melees? No one. And I think it should have been said before the pass came out that it would have like mainly just been melees. You know, you had the crossbow, but. That was basically, that was the only fun thing in the pass, because no one in the game really wants to run around with melees the entire time, especially when they're like this new one, the Poliax, that just, they're not good. Another reason why there shouldn't be so many passes in, t in the game is just because it's turning into pay-to-have content, which bad business was really never before, and at least when you paid for it, uh, the content was good, you know? We got stuff like the SM-03, really enjoyable and unique guns in the game. But with this pass, it's it's different, you know? I mean, it's not enjoyable. Nobody wants to use the Poliax. I mean, 
in a week from now, no one's gonna even remember it's in the game because it's just gonna be completely forgotten. At least when the devs were adding melees before, you could just earn them with rank. You wouldn't have to pay anything unless you paid credits. I remember talking with Ethan once and he said he wanted the game to be somewhat realistic. I think that the creativity for the game has just completely gone down the toilet. Like, we could have added an explosive crossbow or bow or something, you know? It doesn't have to be overpowered. It can, it can be the worst thing in the game, but people will still use it because it's fun. The bow, it wasn't that good. But did people use it? You bet, because it was a fun thing to use. Even though I completely sucked with it and I never really did well with it, I had fun using it. And that's what's important about this game. This is a casual shooter. You're, you're meant to have fun. You're not meant to run around the map and just sweat so hard. That's why the people thought the spammy movement was, you know, a good part of the game. Because it was fun. It added something to the game. A layer of fun. Even though it was sometimes annoying to go up against. I bet, I'd say at least 70% of you had fun using the spammy movement, even if you were outplayed sometimes because of it, or it was annoying to go up against sometimes. I'm sure that most of you had fun with it. And as a content creator for the game, I, I feel like I should speak out about this so that the devs maybe listen to me, but I feel like there needs to be that flair in the game that isn't there now, because the game, it just feels, it feels bland and boring. The movement doesn't really suit the guns, and it especially doesn't suit the knives in the game anymore, or the melees. I feel like if the devs continue down this path, the game's just gonna die, and I don't want that to happen. As much as I don't like the game right now, I definitely don't want it to die. I want to enjoy the game, and that's why I'm making this video, because I don't want it to fail. I, I want to love this game again, like I did before. So, please, devs, if you're watching this, change something. I don't, I don't know what it is, I don't know what you guys should change, I'm not a game developer, I've never developed a game before, but I, the game needs that, the game needs that feeling that it had before, which it doesn't have now because it just feels like a bland FPS game. And I mean, I know that Attachments is supposedly going to make the game a lot better, and it, it probably will, but there still won't be that bad business flair in the game anymore. It'll just feel like yet another FPS game, which it isn't. It had the special movement, it had the guns that added something new to the game, even if they weren't the best. It had those fun maps that suited the movement. It had everything that I enjoyed about it, which has now been somewhat taken away. Uh, yeah, that's all I really have to say. And this video was just purely made because I, I love the game, alright? I don't want any hate towards the devs, I don't want hate towards any of the other content creators, I don't want hate against anybody, I just had to get this off my chest. Thanks for watching.